I am back once more, and in this video we are taking out the BMD-4. Yeah, this this tank, I've had some problems with it, mainly due to the lack of upgrades. Despite having a really good missile that can pretty much pen the front of any tank at its BR, I've not managed to get into a position where I've been able to kill people properly with it. Fingers crossed, uh, we can do better this time around, but let's, uh, let's go. I must be a sneaky tank. That is how we win. I mean, on the plus side, it gets Gen 3 Thermals. And a Bradley! Hmm. Am I blind? I must be blind. Well, there's a kill, finally. I mean, that's been three games. There goes the second guy. Ooh. Well, we got out of that somehow. <laughs> there we go. Ah, uh, turn three. <laughs> that was, I think, the first successful match I've had with that tank in a while. And now when I say a while, I probably mean the past seven matches. Here we go again. I don't have brakes for this thing either, so it's just literally like a it's like trying to slow down moving rock. So loud the engine on this thing. That was that was unnecessary. That was that was way too much. Well, let's see if we can get him. Yeah. There we go. Ah, oh, too late. No. What? Oh, I was unaware, and so was he. What is that? Oh, ooh, that was very close. I saw the flashing light and <laughs> I was like, if I don't, if I didn't get into this ditch fast enough, I knew that was it. I don't usually cap the point first, but I'm going to do it this time because I need to get more upgrades for this thing. There we go. And that is our first victim of the day. Can we get a second victim? Ah, oh, I wasted it. Ah, oh, as if he got my commander. Actually, no, I got his commander. Oh, that was close. It was extremely close. Oh, not again. Not again. There we go. <laughs> Finally got him. Uh oh. That is not good. Oh, that was too close for comfort there. Unfortunately, I don't think I can do anything now without these rockets. Not that I can pen the side armor or whatever. Uh, I just watch him, uh, I'm watching him go over there. Maybe I can overpressure him if I hit the roof. Attention to the map. Come on. Recon reports enemy spotted. Uh, let's just. What are we doing? You know what, I don't even know why I was trying to do that. I could have just shot him in the back. Oh dear, I didn't realise I was this close to their spawn. He knows I'm here. No, how did he get the first shot? Well, that was a more successful match.
There we go. This AMX can be my shield. Whoa. Okay then. Okay, nice. I thought he <laughs> that marker was behind the building. Oh, there goes two. There we go. Fortunately, that didn't get him. No. Uh, yeah. Nice. Another fellow BMD4 in the lobby. I wasn't looking, but then again, I have not been looking either for the entire match. Yeah, I, I really just don't have much luck in this tank. Huh? What? How did I just spawn and my smoke's already been hit? It. Well, I got him. <laughs> nice. Oh, hello, I see you. Nice, there we go. Got that guy. That was extremely close. Uh, there is the one. Uh, nice, he got him. I'm very concerned about spawn behind though because. Yeah, that, that's why. <laughs> nice. <laughs> when you can get this tank into some good positions, it does pay off. But it's actually getting there first. Nice. <laughs> Right, now, now we're doing some serious gaming. Ooh, uh, oh, I forgot he was there. I should have known. Nice, got spawn killed at the end there. I was too busy trying to close my curtain, because the sun is absolutely blinding me right now. Worked better than I thought it was going to. This map is a lot more open as well. There is still a risk of just getting a one tap by the enemy though, which uh, obviously is the case for every light tank. That went better. Fun ain't gonna last for long, I can already feel it. Well, he did not see that one coming <laughs> at all. I've got one more ATGM. This uh this match has gone better than I thought, actually. Uh how, how do you know I was over here? He must have just been looking in this general direction. Greetings! <laughs> nice. Uh oh.
go. What? As soon as I was literally about to press left click, there's someone else. This is a pretty intense situation right now. Oh, what? This guy, I'm gonna get this guy with the plane. This is a pretty close match. But, I guess I'm gonna have to take out the nuke. See him. This is gonna be close. Yes, I got him. <laughs> there we go. Oh, now that that was that was a pretty good match. Read by intelligence. Oh, nice. Um, oh, I really wish we had the breaking for this. Well, we got that guy. <laughs> Fine. Ooh. That is precisely what I was concerned about. Nice. That uh, is going better than I thought. Oh, the, the amount of intelligence the system we're getting is pretty insane. <laughs> Michael, don't leave me here. My God, help me! Oh, we marked him. Nice. <laughs> uh, I was gonna try and get a HE shot on him, but I didn't know where to shoot or what angle I could get him from. Oh. Nice. Oh, a little too late on the timing there. That one wasn't so bad. We did get the assists as well. Ah, yes. Finally, I can pen the side of tanks now. <laughs> uh, next one, probably go for... Oh, I actually think the brakes. We need the brakes on this thing. I finally feel like we possess firepower on this thing for the main turret. Before, I was firing nothing but a water pistol. Now... It's like upgrading to a cannon. <laughs> uh, what is happening? Trees, man. It's always the trees that get in the way. I swear. I... I can't stand trees in this game. I'm not a fan of nature. Can you please put in a petition to remove all trees from War Thunder? That'd be great. There we go. Hi there. <laughs> uh, that was a pretty good shot. Yeah, this is pretty much game at this point. Oh. I got way too greedy. Oh, can we catch this guy off guard? Yes, we can. 
Well, everyone knows we're here now. Got anyone else around the map? Attention to the map. Ice. Oh, it's so nice having these armor piercing rounds finally. Oh, oh what? What? There's no way he was looking in this direction, surely. I think the genius idea will be to try and flank him literally near their spawn if we can just charge through A and go around. But that's getting around their spawn, which is the issue. It's great, I'm gonna try anyway. We can't take him head on. One down. Oh, crap. It wasn't even the AA that got me anyway. Put non penetration. Nice. I really shot the one part of the tank that I couldn't pen. Well, we got a kill. <laughs> I'll take that. I think this is the only Russian SPA I've seen with a fire extinguisher on the back. Or just a Russian tank in general that has a fire extinguisher. I know the challenge is pretty much every single one of their tanks have fire extinguishers on, so... Yeah, I'm pretty concerned for the crew in most cases. Yeah, that, that match went pretty well. I think I made the right choice to go on the left side. Uh, okay, let's not. Let's just die. Let's just die instead. <laughs> oh, come on. Can we get him? Yes, we can. Oh, that's because he's... There we go. <laughs> Ooh, he's hit me. He has hit me. Fine. He only hit our external fuel block, so we are good to go. Actually, no, he hit the radiator. Never mind. Oh, wait, there he is. He's on my ice. Yes, we can. <laughs> wait, it's an elephant. Or a Ferdinand, even. Got uh, another one? Ah, uh, I was too. <laughs> How did I not see the point getting capped? I was too distracted shooting that guy. <laughs> uh, I I just become hyper focused when I'm trying to kill one person, and it always ends up costing me my life for it. Great. I want to kill that leopard. I don't even care. <laughs> yes. I was so close to killing him. He's not even looking at me. Yeah. <laughs> he won. There we go. You know, I genuinely didn't even hear that guy until I just heard the constant firing to my left. Uh, I am really aware. Uh, oh, there's always someone in there. There's always someone just watching someone else. There we go. <laughs> Well, it's a good job he wasn't looking in our direction. But there is a second person, though. What the dog doing? Wait, there's a, there's a third person? Oh, my. There we go. Disable his breach. I think that's about it. Yeah, he's a gunner. <laughs> this tank is very fun when it comes to like 
you see an enemy hidden behind like something else, but you have this missile which can just go right over the top and just go for it straight through them. I love using the UAV just so you can see where everyone is. I, I didn't even know he was there until I spotted him on that. Probably would have drove straight by him. I think it's quite interesting using light tanks though because you actually have to use your intelligence to your advantage. You can't just drive straight in like most games. There we go. It does make some quite interesting gameplay. It's just been so fun just being in this guy. I mean, yeah, there we go. Oh, yeah, that was actually a pretty good match. Using the UAV really helped. Quite a few research points that game. Well, that is the BMD-4 for you. Pretty interesting tank. I actually really enjoyed taking it out this time. I think it's just that initial stock grind, which makes it really painful. And also, adapting to the new play style of actually using light tanks. That's another thing you've got to consider. It's not like medium tanks where you can just charge straight into battle. You have got to think a bit more strategically and where you position yourself and when to push. Uh, I still make the classic mistake of thinking someone's not looking at me when they actually are and I push out and die. But, oh well. Yeah, really good tank though. Good armaments when you get them. Uh, I mean, the ATGM you get anyway is really good. Can just penetrate most tank armor. Uh, even like hiding behind rocks, you can still hit them. Really good transmission, which... Uh, <laughs> isn't actually true for most Russian tanks. Uh, as you know, the T-Series only have, they have really poor mobility reversing. This one, this one can go up to 46 miles per hour in reverse, I believe, or 43 miles per hour in reverse, which is ridiculously fast if you ever need to get out of situations. But all in all, yeah, this tank is all right. It's a good support tank to, to go alongside your main lineup. And for the battle rating with the Gen 3 thermals, really good as well. Uh, but no, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please give it a like comment and subscribe. I really appreciate it. And yeah, I will see you in the next one.